Here are the areas that need painting. So first of all, I think this door might need some touching up because look, there's some scratches there. I know it could probably use a good clean, but then you have the ceiling and the entry. Okay. Then we have the entry because the entry has been chipped in places like there and down there. So it's only a small entry, but the entry needs painting. Coming across here, this is a living room. And this living room needs repainting because there's some damage here. And then there's some damage, kind of some of the walls here. Okay, see there's damage there. So it's not just a clean, it actually needs repainting. All right, then the dining room, the walls are good, but we need the ceiling repainted because it's got that damage there. Okay, now down the hallway, the hallway's not in too bad of shape, but there are some scuffs around the corner here. Like first of all, that doorway, um, but there's some kind of scuffs here. Doesn't look all that great. And if we're gonna be painting, we might as well freshen it up. So I would say freshen up this hallway. So, see scuffs there. This bedroom needs painting. I'm thinking we don't need to do the um, ceilings and we don't even need to do the woodwork, just the walls, okay? Um, bathroom's fine, so don't worry about it. This bedroom needs painting, again, just the walls. Ceiling's fine, woodwork's fine. So again, just the walls. Here we go. And then, that's bedroom number two, and we're going to bedroom number three. This bedroom, again, just the walls. See the walls are pretty damaged. Um, there, walls, 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 walls. See there's scuffs all over there and there. And again, this, ba this bathroom's fine. There's no damage in that bathroom, so it's fine. So, um, maybe even touching up a little bit of the woodwork here because as you can see there's like bad scuffs, but it might clean up, so we'll see. Um, also this closet, it doesn't, it closes, but then it pops open again, so it, see, so that needs to be fixed. So it might just be this mechanism needs to be tightened, like it might just need to be squished so that it can attach itself to there, okay? And then lastly, we're gonna go through the kitchen here. Um, she was asking about touching up the cabinets. So what would it cost to repaint these cabinets? So that's the lower half. There's upper half there, upper, and then we have those there, and those bottom there. Now again, this might just need cleaning. Oh, also this pantry. Oh, here. It might just need cleaning, um, but she'd like to know what it would cost if we were to repaint the cabinets. The other thing is, you see we've got hardware here. They've taken out that hardware there, so we would have to match it or replace. But then we'd have to replace them all. Anyway, so, you know, you've got this, this, there. Okay, anyway, um, that's it. The ceiling in here is fine. So everything else is fine. So let us know how much you think it'll cost there, Steven. Say hi. Hi, Vincent. Okay. So Vincent, let us know how much it's gonna cost. All right, bye.